Won't be long to be playing the last game there at the Coliseum. Sad day, sad day, an emotional day in Oakland as the A's play their last game at the Coliseum. Yeah, Ashley Williams has been there live in the parking lot all morning long talking to the fans who are there to say goodbye this morning. You picked up, oh, I thought that was an A's jacket you had on too. Uh, how's it going? Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's amazing, guys. Uh, it's starting to thin out in the parking lot because the gates officially opened inside or at the Coliseum, I should say, we're in the parking lot. But what I'm loving right now, uh, being, of course, amongst the fans, but the fog has finally lifted and now you can finally see the Oakland Hills. You've been showing that shot since four o'clock this morning and now we can finally see the beautiful homes that sit on top of the home. Uh, fans are getting hot dogs before they head inside uh, and uh, folks out here signing autographs. In fact, he's kind of busy right now, but this is the guy who will be the new announcer for the Oakland A's when they come to West Sacramento. He's having fun with the fans. Of course, these are the fans that we will see in Sacramento soon. Uh, with that said, let's talk about the energy coming into the Coliseum for the final game at the Coliseum. Tell me your name. Go A's. Uh, I'm Austin. I'm Julian. What's up, man? Where are you guys from? We're from Oakland. From Oakland. All right. What was it like? walking into the Coliseum this this morning. Oh, it was great. Atmosphere is great. I haven't seen a game like this in a long time. Price since the reverse boycott. Um, but we're here. We showed out last game. I know we've been showing out all week. It's going to be great. Hopefully we end it with a dub. How are you feeling? Oh, man, nostalgic. Like that last walk across the bridge today with my brother and my people. I, this is childhood for us, and we're here to cap it off the right way. We love Oakland. We respect the A's, and we hope, you know, this legacy lives on forever, baby. Yeah, I mean, you're his brother. Tell me your name. And he, I mean, he said this is nostalgic for you guys. So what was the emotion like earlier today walking over? Yeah, my name's Woo! Adrian. We, we grew up coming to this stadium. This is truly home to us. So uh, a lot of nostalgia, a lot of sadness, uh, but trying to keep the vibes high and trying to support our A's through, through everything. You guys have fun in there. You guys have fun in there. That game kicking off in just a little bit, guys, taking on awesome. the Thank Rangers. You. But earlier we had a chance to talk with a gentleman who was at the very first game in 1968. Take a listen. This hat was bought for me by my dad at the very first Oakland A's game in April 1968. I was seven years old. I still have some autographs. Dave Duncan, Campy Campanaris. There's some, I had Rick Monday. There were some others, but that have faded. But this has been, I, I usually, this usually sits sits on my wall. I don't usually wear it, but I thought I wore it at the very first Oakland A's game and now I'm wearing it at the very last. I mean, how great is that? How great is that first hat at this game in 1968 and wearing it now in 2024 for the final home game? Uh, by the way, this might be it for the A's in Oakland, but of course they're coming to West Sacramento. The first game against the Chicago Cubs, March 31st. So if you love the A's, we'll see you out there. Back on over to you. Okay, thank you so much, Ashley. You did a great job out there today. Yeah, thank great you, Ash. Job. Fall is 